Welcome back to Sydney, Australia. As you can see, it's it's bright. It's it's a sunny day. It's hot. It's windy. We're in Sydney, Sydney CBD. You can see the Harbour Bridge behind me. Uh, it's a busy day. It's it's so bright that you're you're struggling to see anything actually. Oh, there you go. There's a little little bit. Could just be the. Uh, brightness of the camera. I'm not exactly sure. But I'll talk about the importance of learning cold approach regardless of whether you are having success or not. Now let's just say you are an attractive guy and you just swipe right on Tinder a few times. You go on Instagram, you're a superstar. Uh, let's just say you have a, a large social circle and you're having success anyway. You're, you're making a lot of uh, contacts with girls through uh, through work or through your group of friends and you think that cold approach is not for you. Now, I'd like to talk about something that happened to myself recently and uh, another use for cold approach that not a lot of guys talk about. Uh, but before we kick it off, check out the top link in the description, check out my website. Uh, I've got a whole bunch of articles there, over 300 articles. You can check out my book if you want to know uh, my history. It's like an autobiography of myself. And uh, I've also got a digital product in there which is for total beginners. If you're a total beginner and you're not sure about cold approach, uh, this will at least give you a bit of a uh, an understanding on what cold approach is. It's a 30 day challenge and it's relatively cheap as well. Hopefully you can hear me okay. Hopefully I'm speaking loud enough. So, there's so many use cases for cold approach and every now and then uh, I use it. I don't really focus on it, but I use cold approach to approach people for business purposes. Now, I get it, there's a lot of salesmen out there that do, uh, they, they knock on doors, they cold approach businesses, they turn up and they try to sell their things. Cold approach in the street could be used to get yourself a job. And myself recently, I recognized one of Australia's most successful men. Uh, he lives in a almost $20 million mansion. He runs one of Australia's largest companies. He is an extremely successful, wealthy, businessman and I saw him in the street and I cold approached him now obviously there's a, a slight difference between approaching a, a woman trying to get a date trying to get some contact information trying to build some rapport there's a slight difference but not a large difference between building rapport uh, with a girl there's there's obviously a, a quite a few differences but uh, let's just say you are uh, you see an extremely successful man and you want to get a job. Uh, I approached this guy because I was curious about him, his job. We got talking, we ended up going out for a coffee and hanging out. And uh, we started talking about what I was doing. I told him I was teaching pickup and uh, we talked about multiple things. He then hired me, we, we ended up sitting down and having another lunch with his team, his team came along, and then he ended up hiring me to coordinate a social media strategy for him, because I've obviously spent a lot of time on social media, I have uh, building this thing here right in front of you guys, uh, so I have uh, some knowledge and, you know, baseline understanding probably more than most people because uh, a lot of the people who work in social media don't really have their own social media accounts so I effectively cold approached uh, an extremely successful businessman who has now hired me as a client um, hired me as a consultant sorry he's my client uh, and so there's many use cases for learning cold approach it's not just to find a girlfriend, get laid, etc. Uh, it could also just enhance every other aspect of your life. You could maybe make some friends that way as well. And uh, I just thought I'd make that video because people often don't link the two. They think that, oh, if you're approaching to get laid, 
it's it's extremely different to, to, between approaching for business purposes. There are some differences, um, uh, but if you get good at approaching girls and you can get laid by approaching girls, you can find yourself a girlfriend that way. It will also overflow into other aspects of your life. Uh, so let's just say you come and uh, do some coaching with myself. I take you out in the street, take you into a few bars. You get good at approaching girls. You develop that skill. It might not only get you a girlfriend, but could also enhance your business life. So just keep that in mind. If you're interested in doing some cold approach coaching with myself, top link in the, in the description, I've got unlimited free content out there 300 blog posts on the website and uh, over 500 or 600 videos on this channel as it is see you guys in the next video